Hi children, how are you? Today we are going to start our new chapter that is the food and feeding habits of animals. Okay, let's start. If you are hungry, what will you do? Yes, definitely you will eat something. Isn't it? Like that all living things need food. Isn't it? Yes, all living things need food. What are the function of or what are the benefits of food? Yes, we need food to grow, to live and to stay healthy. To grow, to live and to stay healthy. Who gives us energy to work and play? Yes, our food. So, the uses of food are to the food help us to live, to grow, to stay healthy and give energy to work and play. Okay. Based on the food habit, the animals are classified as three. The animals are classified as three. Which are they? I, I, I know. You might study it in the lower classes. Isn't it? Yes. The animals are classified as herbivores, carnivores and omnivores. Okay. Herbivores. Herbivores, carnivores and omnivores. Can you see this feature? Yes. The animal like cow, goat, buffalo eat only plants. Such type of animals are called the herbivores. Herbivores are the plants. Uh, sorry, herbivores are the animals. They eat only plants. Example, cow, goat, buffalo, etc. The second one, carnivores. What is carnivores? Yes. Can you see this? Yes, the animal like lion, leopard, tiger eat only flesh of other animals. Isn't it? The animal eat the flesh of other animals are called the carnivores. Okay, the examples are lion, tiger, leopard. And the third one, omnivores. Omnivores. Omnivores eat both plants and the flesh of other animals. Example, crow, bear, dog, etc. What about human beings? We know we human beings eat both plants and the flesh of other animals or meat, isn't it? So we are omnivores. We humans are omnivores. Okay, let us see the video. Different animals eat different types of food, isn't it? Some animals eat plants, some eat flesh of other animals, some eat both, both plants and animals. Based on the food habit, the animals are classified into as herbivores, carnivores and omnivores. Isn't it? Yes. Can you see that? Lion. Lion is a carnivore because it eats the flesh of other animals. What about the zebra? Zebra eat only plant or plant products. So such type of animals are called the herbivores. Herbivores are the animals eat only plants. And what about this bubble? It eat both plants and animals. So it's a omnivore. Omnivore. Bubble is an omnivore. Then we are going to discuss about pet animals and domestic animals. First, pet animals. Do you have pets at your home? Yes, the animals like cat, dog, rabbits are pet animals. They live with us, isn't it? Do you play with your cat? Yes, they give company. Yes, the animals like dog, cat, rabbits are called a pet animals. We should provide good food and shelter for them to keep them healthy and safe. Okay, so an example for pet animals are... Cat, dog. Next, domestic animals. Domestic animal. Can you see this picture? This answer animals like goat, cow, chicken are called domestic animals. They help us many ways. They help us many ways. For example, uh, the cow and uh, goat give us 
Yes, the cow and goat give us milk. What about the hen and chicken? Yes, they give egg for us, isn't it? Do you like eggs? They give egg for us. So, animals like cow, goat, chicken are called the domestic animals. They help us in many ways. And we also give good food and a shelter for them. Okay, the examples are? Okay. Okay, different animals eat in different ways. Okay, first we are going to discuss about novos. The word is, the spelling is D-N-A-W-E-R-S, novos. G is silent, we can say novos. Okay, children. Okay, have you seen the rabbit, squirrel, uh, rat? What are these eat? eat? These animals eat? Yes, nuts, grains, fruits, etc. Can you see this picture? This is the teeth of a front teeth of a squirrel. Can you see that it's very sharp and it's very sharp, has very sharp front teeth. These animals eat with the help of these front teeth. Animals like rabbit, squirrel, rat with the help of eat food with the help of front teeth. They cut, they chew and eat food with the help of this front teeth. Such type of animals are called the novos. Such type of animals are called the novos. Rabbit, squirrels are the scab, rats are the example of novos. So, novos are the animals. They eat food with the help of sharp front teeth. The novos are also called the rodents. What? Rodents. Let's see how a rabbit eat food. An example of a nova, they eat with the help of its sharp front teeth. The animals like rabbit, squirrel eat with the help of its sharp front teeth. Such type of animals are called novas. Such type of animals are called novas. They also called rodents. They also called rodents, isn't it? The second type is that animal that swallow the food whole. Can you see this picture? Yes, this is a baby and a grandmother. How do they eat food? Yes, they swallow the food. Why? Because they don't have teeth. Like that, animals like uh, frog, lizard and snake don't have teeth. They also swallow the food. Okay, let's see. How, the, how do the frog catch insects and uh, swallow? Frog swallow the insects. Frog trap the insect with its tongue and uh, then swallow them. Okay, what is this? This is earthworm. What is the food of earthworm? Yes, earthworm eat soil. Earthworm also swallow the soil. What about the snake? Snake has a very small mouth. It, sw it opens its mouth very wide to swallow the insects. Let's see how a snake swallow insects also swallow the food can you see that the snake try to swallow its food let's see
So children, today we studied about the food and feeding habits of animals based on the, the food help us to live, to grow and stay healthy and also provide energy to work and play. And based on the food habit, the animals are classified as herbivores, carnivores and the omnivores. So herbivores are the animals that eat only plants. What about carnivores? Carnivores eat the flesh of other animals. And omnivores are the animals they eat both plants and the animals. Okay. And animals are also classified as pet animals and a domestic animal. The animals like dog, cat, rabbits are called a pet animals. What about domestic animals? The animals like cow, goat, uh, hen are called a domestic animals. And on the basis of food habit, the animals are also classified as novas. The first one is novas. Novas are the animals that those eat food with the help of sharp front teeth. The second one is that the animals that swallow the food as a whole because they don't have teeth. They swallow the food. Okay. Okay, children. Thank you.